Hey, what's up guys? Um, got a little project that I'm working on today. Um, we've got to make these, uh, twist capture pieces that I, uh, um, have to put on a project. So I, uh, went to my laser cutter and, uh, let's see if I can spin this around real quick. And, uh, this is what we cut out. This will actually be a, um, uh, a slotted screw and it will be bound to a lock nut washer and just spin in a 90, 90 degree orientation and uh, in doing so it'll lock this panel in place with four of these but I need to make little rising bumps off of this something to make contact with the mating surface and um, I'm going to show you what I set up here on my iron worker So, essentially, what I've done here is uh, set up a quarter inch die to quarter inch, um, sorry, yeah, quarter inch die uh, punch. And a while back, I found the need of having finer tune adjustability um, in my, my Z throw here. And so what I did is I, I kind of made a section open right here and um, made uh, a piece of threaded rod and some high quality nuts on here. I uh, welded some stop points here and here for the max throw. Uh, but now I can actually come here, dial down exactly where I want sorry, uh, dial exactly my throw. So I just set that up and I'm gonna turn this on real quick. And focus. And I set it up so I can kind of see where I'm at. So I'm gonna come down and I made that adjustment. That's that's a stopping point right there. So let me focus there. And you can see that I can still slide that uh, stainless piece underneath of this. So now, by doing that, I can go up and I can come back down and it still stops right there. As you can see, it still slides under. So now I can go up, I can come in here, find my center, I'll make center points on these. But then I'll just come down into the material, off, and that was off center, but we got plenty of spares, but now I have my bumped part, so pretty easy, quick and dirty, but it gives me just a little uh, surface edge to, um, to, uh, make contact with the mating surface when it rotates. And so it doesn't get bound up on this edge here or an edge. It'll actually slide up on this part right here, kind of making contact in only one wear point versus a whole surface. So that's how I uh, made these little pieces and thought you guys might be able to, or be interested in seeing that. So uh, thanks a lot.